Welcome to Bokapat ABC Tanojang, Jungdung Dongsa Pyeon. Today is month 3, day 19. Our first word of the day is distract. Distract. 한국 말로는 흐트러뜨리다, 산만하게 하다, 또는 벗어나게 하다. 영어로 설명하면 to divide, 분리하다, or confuse, 그, 혼란스럽게 하다. The attention of a person. 어떤 사람의 집중을, 어떤 사람의 관심을. It's to get someone off their task. 뭐 어떤 해야 하는 일 있으면 그거 방하는 거예요. 그럼 뭐그그 그 해야 하는 일이랑 벗어나게 하는 거예요. So, as you might see, sometimes big words can distract us from what we're supposed to be reading. Or, in this photo, we can see it says, I am easily distract, funny. So the person got distracted in the middle of writing it. 그냥 집중 못했던 못 거예요. 쉽게 그 흐트러드리게 되니까. So basically, if you're easily distracted, 집중하기, 집, 집중하기 힘든 거예요. So distracted on 비슷한 말은 divert. Divert, 벗어나게 하다. Sidetrack, sidetrack. 산만, 산만하게 하다. Draw away. 그 딴데로 그 따라오라고 하는 거예요. So you might draw away someone from the path. If, if you are driving in a car, you might see a sign that looks interesting and you might be drawn away from the road. So, you could say smartphones sometimes distract us from our concentration. 그 스마트폰들이 가끔은 우리를 그 집중하는 걸 방해합니다. Or, they, they distract us, they keep us from being able to concentrate, to focus. Our next word is disturb. Disturb. 한국말로는 방해하다. 결란시키다 또는 귀찮게 하다. 영어로 설명하면 to interfere with. 방해하는 거예요. So, as you can see on these signs, it says, please do not disturb. 우리를 방해하지 마세요. Do not disturb. 방해하지 마세요. So, what this means is often in hotels or other places where maids might come in, 그 청소해주는 사람들이, they have these do not disturb signs, meaning 이거는 그 오지 마세요. 제가 뭐 자고 있어요. So these mean don't come and disturb someone's sleep. But disturb refers to anything. So if you, for instance, threw a rock into a pond of water, if you threw a rock into a pond of water, the water around it would be disturbed by the, by the um, rock landing inside it. So, disturb means to interfere with, to interrupt something. So, 한, 그 disturb이랑 비슷한 말은 interrupt, 그 방해하다, hinder, 방해하다, bother, 그 귀찮게 하다, 또는 disrupt, 또 방해하는 뜻이에요. So, it's stopping something or changing something that needs to occur in a certain way. So, you could say, actually, I didn't want to disturb you. 아, 죄송해요. 제가 사실은 제가 실, 어, 일부러 방하지 않았습니다. 제가 일부러 방하지 않았습니다. 방, 방하는 생각 없었습니다. 실제로. So actually, I didn't want to disturb you. The next word is drag. Drag. 한국말로는 끌다. 질질 끌다. 끌리다. 영어로 설명하면 to pull or be pulled with force. 강하게 끄는 거나 뭐 끌리는 거예요. Especially along the ground or other surface. 특히 바닥에서, 땅에서. You might drag, you usually drag something. Either you might drag something across a screen or you would drag it across the ground. Or you might be dragged out of somewhere. Like this person is being dragged out of a prison. This woman is dragging a bag full of sand. These soldiers are dragging another soldier. 
and this spider is dragging another bug. So drag means to move along on the ground. Drag it on Gistan Marin pull. Pull. Gulda. Draw. Draw means to bring someone bring something from somewhere to another place. Hall. Hall is a similar meaning to drag, except it's not necessarily on the ground. Ildoro mo tadong taro ku trailer hall has to be So hall means to pull something, to move it somewhere, but not necessarily on the ground. And then trail. Trail. So if we said someone dragged behind, or if we said someone trailed behind, trailed behind, it means like they're pulling their body, they're dragging their body behind everyone else. So drag behind, trail behind means they're pulling themselves behind. They're dragging themselves. So you could say he dragged his chair towards the table. He brought, he pulled his chair, he dragged his chair to the table, towards the table. The next word is drip. Drip. So it's not hudida. Hudida would be to flow. To drip is just bloop, bloop, one water drop at a time. Water droplet or water drop at a time. So, 영어로 설명하면 to fall in drops. 물방 우리로 떨어지는 거예요. To fall in drops. So, if we look at these, we can see this water or these icicles are melting and water is dripping from them. Or the water dripping into this cup of water is making a splash. This water droplet is dripping upwards. And this would be an example of a water droplet, something that would drip. Dribble. Dribble is 점점 흐러지다. Drop is 떨어지다. And trickle is Whereas drip has more of the 물방울이 중요한 거예요. Droplets 필요한다는 말이에요. So water is dripping from that leaky faucet. So if we said water was trickling, it would mean 조금 흐리고 있다. 근데 dripping이라는 말 하니까 그 leaky faucet에서 그 한국말로 faucet 뭐예요? 그 수도 꼭지에서 물이 물방울 그 물방울이 똑똑 떨어지다 천천히 막그 드립이라는 거는 막 빠르게 흐르는 게 아니라 그냥 점점 물이 내 내리는 거예요. So water is dripping from that leaky faucet. 